Your connection in Southern Oregon and Northern California. This is News 10 at 5. Good evening, I'm Trish Close. Thanks for joining us. Rick has the night off. A brutal murder near Portland, eerily similar to a near beheading in Ashland. Are the cases connected? News since Caitlin Conrad has the answer in tonight's top story at 5. Caitlin? Trish, Ashland police are looking into the murder of a Lake Oswego man to see if the suspect arrested in the Clackamas County case is the same man responsible for killing David Michael Grubbs. It's been more than 10 months since 23-year-old Grubbs was nearly beheaded along the Greenway in Ashland. Investigators say they look into any and all cases that have similarities to the Grubbs killing. The latest case is the murder of Lake Oswego man Fritz Hayes. He was also nearly beheaded with a machete. Clackamas County police have suspect Eric Miser in custody. He and Hayes had no prior connection. Ashland detectives believe a stranger also killed Grubbs. Right now, police don't know if there's a connection. We absolutely look into all those incidents, look for similarities, look for what happened there. Um, we were aware of the incident that happened in Lake Oswego. Uh... Miser was arrested in Corvallis and is charged with Hayes' murder. Police say the suspect broke into the man's home early on the morning of September 17th. Grubbs was killed on the railroad tracks just after dark on November 19th, 2011. There is a reward fund set up for David Michael Grubbs. Anyone with information leading to the arrest and conviction of the person responsible could earn more than $21,000. Covering your news, Caitlin Conrad, News 10.